What's your favourite food, Sarah? Oh, I guess it'd have to be a pasty. A pasty? Yeah, it's not any old pasty, though. A car's pasty from Bolton. Yeah, and I understand that uh, you had pasties at a certain special celebration? Yes, I had pasties at my wedding. I think, Joe, you're a fan of someone on YouTube who's going to show us how to cook pasties. Yes, that's right. She's uh, my absolute favourite YouTuber. Her name's Kay. Here she is doing Cornish pasties. Hi, people. I'm back cooking again. I was supposed to be making creme brulee, but unfortunately, I can't get no ramekins anywhere. So, I've decided today I'm going to make... Cornish pasties. Yeah. As good a reason as any. Obviously, the hardest part of a Cornish pasty is getting the pastry right, but she's very good at that. That's your meat, and that's your veg. And to... I think she might have overfilled that one. To turn it over and crimp it. <laughs> have another go. Why does my stuff always fall out? What you do is, oh no. You turn it over like that. Every video is like this. I've watched all of them. They're so good. <laughs> um, let's see how they look finally. This is the end product, and believe it or not, these did stick together. Mmm, yum yum. <laughs> Make you want to get back in the kitchen, Sally? Oh, totally. I'm desperate to get back in the kitchen <laughs> and fold some meat in some pastry. <laughs> <laughs> Putting that in the fun capsule. Hey. <laughs> See, I like Kay's cooking tutorials, but I often find that a tutorial works best with a bit of music, as captured perfectly in this unique Wendy's Burger training video. Now, working the grill, Bill, it ain't so tough. But first of all, you got to check your stuff. Like a grill, that's it. 250 with the meat and cheese that's ready to go. A towel to keep your station looking cool. But most of all, you got to have your tools. about cooking burgers. I love it. Well, if only Kay from Kay's Good Cooking would incorporate a bit of music into her tutorials, I think they might be easier to follow. Kay could learn a lot from the Wendy's training video. So you mean using the Wendy's training video as a training video to make training videos? <laughs> exactly, Joe. <Jack. laughs> it's Kay from Kay's Good Cooking! I've seen it, Harry, and I've got loads of ideas how to improve my training videos. <laughs> my name is Kay. I'm going to make a pasty. Why is that, Kay? Glad you asked. We've got loads of beef that I need to use. She's got a lot of spuds and onions, too. Well, let the pastry on top of the hob. If the pasty falls apart, she ain't done her job. Grease up the trays so they're good to go. I pop them in the oven for an hour or so. Just one question when I cook. Okay, does it taste as good as it looks? I tell you now, you think I'm crazy. She wouldn't swap brulee for a beef and pastry. When I say K, you say cooking. K! Cooking! K! Cooking! My cooking be good, but my wrapping it be nasty. That's how K cooks a Cornish pasty. Yeah. Yeah. Right. I'm sticking K into the fun capsule. My thanks to Joe Lysett, Sally Lindsay, Philip Bannister, Sarah Cox and Kay for helping me film the fun capsule this week. That's all from us. Good night! Yeah.